everybody, it's me Nance. And no, I don't work at the fast food chain. <laughs> you wish. But for this video, I decided to wear my fried potato sweater, my fried potato and hamburger hair tie. Everything with plenty of trans fat because we're gonna be talking about something. About something everybody loves and everybody hates. McDonald's! You guys won't believe what evil thing McDonald's Japan just did. They took fries, potato in Japanese, and chocolate, chocolate in Japanese, and then, ugh, Choco Potato was born. That was back in February, but unfortunately, it was only limited edition, so I didn't get to try. But luckily, it was so so popular, they made two more versions of Choco Potato. Two more versions! Now this looks like a normal brown bag from McDonald's, right? Wrong! This is not just any brown bag from McDonald's. This is a brown bag from McDonald's from Japan. And here we have two packs of real Choco Potato. And fitting to Autumn, they have a spooky Halloween theme. <laughs> I am a pumpkin filled with fries. Therefore, I'm a pumpetto, a pumpkin potato. Pumpetto! <laughs> Each pack of fries comes with pumpkin chocolate sauce and sweet potato chocolate sauce. So when you open the box, you just meet your normal McDonald's fries. But bend it backwards and drizzle over the fries. Don't forget to suck out the remaining pumpkin chocolate sauce. Mm. This literally tastes like pumpkin pie. Next we have chocolate and sweet potato. Interesting combination. Well, I guess you could say this pretty much tastes like outer space. Purple sweet potato, choco potato looks really cute. Then orange is pretty cool as well. It looks more like a dessert, but I think it's also why they're limited edition. And actually, they will end tomorrow, so I was really, really lucky to get them before they end, and not like last time. But hey, Choco Potato came back again, and this time in two different variations, so good things always happen, or sometimes even better things. But before we try this curiosity, we'll have to do some fortune telling. Chocolate sauce fortune telling to be exact. So if you take a picture of your choco potato, upload it to Twitter and hashtag it choco sauce udanai, which is Japanese for chocolate sauce fortune telling. Then McDonald's Japan will tell you within a few minutes your personality type according to the way you drizzled the chocolate sauce over your fried potato. Let's try it! I already got an answer. So according to this McDonald's pumpkin lord, the way I drizzled my choco sauce over the potato means that I am a confident genius. But then again, the Purple sweet potato chocolate sauce says something different. I am a clumsy Cinderella. Well, that's quite the contrast. What does fried potato combination chocolate sauce actually taste like? Mm. <laughs> Pardon me, my real self just showed. Pumpkin combination chocolate sauce combination fried potato tastes bomb ethically good, but it's 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 like a pumpkin pie disguised as fries. But I really think it would make great friends with pumpkin spice latte. They should really have like babies together. Now I have to admit something and this might be weird, especially coming from a person who eats fermented soybeans for breakfast, but sweet potato chocolate alone tastes great. But it just seems a bit peculiar on fried potatoes.
what is this? I'm not really sure what I'm feeling because at this point I think McDonald's is actually trying to troll us. The sweet potato chocolate sauce is yummy alone, but sweet potato on top of a normal potato is just... My brain just can't process this. They could have made sweet potato fries and potato sauce and it would be the same weirdness. Well, I mean, if you can put chocolate sauce on top of fries, wouldn't caramel sauce work as well? Yummy, 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 yum. And definitely better than sweet potato sauce on potatoes. So, does McDonald's in your country have any weird or secret items on the menu? Like choco potato? Comment below and see you soon in my next video. Bye bye, boo!